Hey guys, as you can see, uh, this black is not uh, very deep and uh, shiny, I guess. Um, you can see it uh, has a little bit of gray in it. Um, same with this. We're going to try and uh, revive, make that come back to a nice deep black with this stuff. Um, again, I'm not uh, affiliated with this company at all. Um, I just find it works pretty well and this is what I have. So um, I'll just show you kind of what I do. And it's just a plastic uh, bumper uh, trim revitalizer. That's all. So just makes everything look new again. Uh, if you do this on your own car, uh, not like these toys, don't put it on a steering wheel. It's uh, it's, 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 it's kind of like a slippery type thing, so uh, it's a safety hazard, and it will say right on it. Not intended. Do not use on a steering wheel. But as you can see, probably already, um, we're getting that sheen back, and it's looking starting to look a lot newer now. And it doesn't take a whole it doesn't take a whole lot of this product. It sp spreads around pretty good.
good all back together she runs oh she burns out in reverse jeez there we go uh, so it's a lot the windows are a lot better than uh, what they were they were pretty pretty yellow like the front headlights there um, yeah that's pretty much it might take these headlights off and just sand them down a bit, try to clear them up, but that's that's pretty much it. This build's done. I'm gonna get it on, uh, post the ad online and get rid of it. So uh, for my next project, uh, my next one is uh, that bad boy right over there. So stay tuned.